What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Hunter X here, bringing us another episode of Project Ozone 3 Titan Mode Overworld. With that being said, hope you guys are all having a fantastic day. Let's get right into the episode. Alrighty, so in today's episode, I have a little bit of a change of heart again. There it is, dot com. Uh, switching it up a little bit. Now, we need drops of evil really badly, right? We need drops of evil really badly. So, soul vial. We're going to go ahead and try to go to the hunting dimension really quickly and see if we can find ourselves uh, a wither skeleton and capture it. Um, that way we can make a spawner of it, which would be super nice, right? Have a nice little spawner of it and all the, all the fun stuff, right? So, we're going to go ahead and go to the hunting dimension. Now, the hunting dimension is a little scary at first glance but it is what it is we just need a drop of evil right or two technically we need two drops of evil because we need one for the cursed lasso and another for the um um mob spawner all right everything kind of got blown up over here uh oh i hear i hear skeletons and things but i need a wither skeleton uh are you with a skeleton you are with a skeleton so i'm gonna take you I'm going to take your soul, and I'm going to borrow your soul. Let's get out of here before we die, because we don't want that to happen, right? So, there's a few things I would need to make. A.K.A. a powered spawner. We need to get a spawner from the nether, particularly a blade spawn from the nether, which is fine, because those are easy. Those are uh, pretty easy to come by. We're going to go ahead and throw this in here, so that way we don't lose our wither skeleton, right? Uh, so, powered spawner. Power spawner is going to need a couple of machines. So that means we're going to have to do a little bit of work today to uh, get ready and prepare for said thing, right? So we're going to need two vibrant crystals. We're going to need a soul machine chassis. So we're going to go ahead and make one of those. One of these are pretty easy to make, simple machine chassis. We can craft those, that right away. Actually, no, um, we can. We just got to get our iron here and go ahead and swap that iron out for this iron bada bing bada boom so we've got our simple machine chassis all right so now to get the soul attuned dye blend we're gonna need a few things organic brown we're gonna need organic black and solium dust and crushed quartz but we already have that taken care of so solarium powder it's just gonna be solarium crushed up so we're gonna go ahead and grab two of those right so one two I'm going to go ahead and crush that baby up, right? And then the other ones are a little bit more complicated. Now, can I do this in the manufactory? I can. Perfect. That's going to take some time. And why is it every time I record, it is nighttime? It's every single time. All right. So to get black organic dye, we're going to need to take some slime balls and go ahead and melt those bad boys up in the smeltery with some or not smeltery sorry in the alloy furnace with some coal right so let's go ahead and do that that's also going to take actually can i do this in the induction smelter i don't think i can do this in the induction smelter no it won't let me do it in the induction smelter what about this alloy furnace um no can't do it in that one either so it has to be the under io alloy smeltery all right let's go ahead and toss that in there Oh, wait, no, it's pulverized coal. Ah, I see now. All right, let's go ahead and do a half a stack of that. Now, do we have a pulverizer? I don't think we've made a pulverizer yet. No, we haven't made a pulverizer yet. That's fine. We'll go ahead and make that. So, for the organic green dye, I need to remember exactly what it is again. It's going to be uh, brown pigment and crushed. Okay, so we need jungle saplings. Now, I'm sure, oh, well, we got to do some sifting first. So, let's grab some dirt here. A couple stacks of dirt. Now, do we have our string mesh? We do have our string meshes. All right, perfect. I'm going to go ahead and do some dirt sifting, and we'll be right back. All righty. So, <clears throat> we need organic brown dye, right? So, the brown dye just needs some coal again some coal and need some of that um slime stuff oh i literally 
Really? Go over there. Go over there. And then we're going to go ahead and put some of this in here. Now, how many of these are we going to actually need? So it's six per two. So let's go ahead and do six only. Since we only made about half a stack. And that's going to be... That should cover us for a minute. And... So we need two coal. So two, 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 one, two. Okay, so we need two. So let's do one, two, three, four sets of that stuff. And then that should be good. So we've got our organic brown dye. Now the green stuff. Oh, wait, we don't need the green stuff. Right, 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 right. Because we're doing the soul. The soul stuff, right? The soul tune stuff. And then we also need crushed nether wart as well. So let's, let's go ahead and grab that. Let's go ahead and grab ourselves some crushed nether wart. So we have organic brown and organic black. So we need some of the soul tune dye. Okay, we're missing crushed nether quartz. So quartz. We can go ahead and crush some of that up. Let's go ahead and get four. So that means we're going to need to either crush it in the manufactory or the crusher. We'll, we'll find out. So go ahead and throw that in there. That's going to take a minute, so we will be right back. Alrighty, guys. So we need to go ahead and craft ourselves some of that soul tune dye. Bada bing, bada boom. And then come over to our induction smelter and take our, sing our simple chassis and combine that with one of our soul attuned dye blends which is going to give us the soul chassis which is going to in theory allow us to craft some of the machines that we need to make our powered spawner would you look at that so we need some sort of head okay hold on we actually might need a second one here so we need the slice and splice which needs um yep another one of the soul attuned dye chess chassis so let's go ahead and get one of those an, an extra one of those I'm going to go ahead and put this in there. And we need to go ahead and craft another one of those simple chassis, which is super easy. Relatively easy. We go ahead and do that, do that. And again, this thing stinks when it comes to ore dictionary items. Uh, we really do need to get an applied energistic system ASAP. There we go. Go ahead and put that back in there. And uh, we're, okay, right, our induction smelter. Bada bing, bada boom. Get that in there and call it a day, right? And that will allow us to craft our so-called amazing machine. The oh wait, we need energetic stuff. Um, mm, okay, energetic blend. I gotta remember how to make that. That that stuff is gonna be a pain in a butt. Blend this stuff right here. Hey, stop it! Stab it! There we go. So it's just going to be some redstone and glowstone. Alright, we'll craft eight of those. So that means we're going to need eight gold. Gold ingots. So let's go ahead and craft eight of those bad boys. And then we need to cook that up in the ice smelter. So with that being said, once that's done, because this is going to take a minute, we'll be right back. Alrighty, guys. So we need to go ahead and make these bimetal gears, which means we need iron nuggets. Now... I had to, I have to record this during my live stream, you know, because somebody is a derp and couldn't finish the recording. This horse, listen, park it right here and stay there. Jesus. All right, there we go. Now we can make these bimetal gears that we need to go ahead and, oh, we need more grains of infinity. Do we not have any grains of infinity? Uh, flint and steel, maybe. Okay, that's in our inventory. Now, where did we go to do our thing again? Oh, that's right. I think it's gonna be like slash warp. Uh, mob farm, nether, temp farm, mob farm, nether, temp farm. Where did I put that hole? There was a hole I made in the ground somewhere. That was meant for our Grands of Infinity farm. I, I never set up a war point, I don't think. Oh, no. 
All right, now we gotta go find a hole that's somewhere here. Cause you know, is it by the chest that we're on this side? I don't even. I don't even remember. <sighs> this is this is gonna be great. Um, where's a place that we know that has lots and lots of bedrock? I mean, the hunting dimension. We could go to the hunting dimension to do it. Is it on this side? It might be on this side. Yeah, found it. I found my hole. Going down the hole. Down the hole we go. Oh, that's right. That I forgot this is still down here. Oh, there's 27 of them. Okay. There it is. I got myself 27 grades of infinity. There it is. Dot com. All right. Now we need two of these. So let's go ahead and do that. There we go. Oh, no. I think I already had to. Cramp. Cramp. All right. Yep. There we go. Hey. There we go. So we need two of those. For this guy dot com. One, two. Alright, now we need Is that all? Okay, we need iron bars and we need some sort of skeleton head in solarium. That's gonna be soul sand. Let's go ahead and make eight more soul sand and gold times one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There we go. We can go ahead and make some of that. Alley furnace it up. There we go. And then we're going to need to somehow get a skeleton head. Um, we could, in theory, make beheading. But I'm going to go ahead and try and go to the hunting dimension. Hunt some skeletons. And maybe get some heads. So with that being said, I will be right back. All right, guys, we finally got a freaking head after dying multiple times in a row. Finally got a skeleton head. I think it's because the charge creeper blew up the skeleton. So that's why we got a, a, a head. But yeah, anyways, we got ourselves a nice little head. And yeah, so we're going to go ahead and grab ourselves... The slice and splice. Yes, the slice and splice. There we go. We are going to need our lead stone flux ducts. And it's, oh my god, it's nighttime again. I just wish it could just be permanently daytime. Like, forever. Like, seriously. It is nighttime every time I go to go record. Every single time. It's just like, what the flying farts? Is going on here every single time every single time all right nice now that we've got that out of the way now we just need another head actually no we need another two heads because we need we need uh what you call it Um, one for the Z-Logic controller. Well, well, I, can I actually show you guys how many deaths I have? That's just here in the overworld. Oh, you just wait. The amount of times I, I had to slash back to get my stupid gravestone. Dude, I died so many times in the hunting dimension. It's not even funny how many times I've actually died in the process. Alright, does it show it here? 
One, two, three, four, five times. It feels like more than five times. All right, well, we need a zombie head. So let's go find a zombie. I can't tell what that is. That's a zombie. <gasps> That's a zombie wearing a skeleton head. Oh my God, he only dropped the skeleton head. So we, we got one part done. We just need to grab a zombie head. And that's it. And then we'll be ready to make our farm. All right, what did we, did we get a zombie head? It's not what I wanted. I want a zombie head. Do we have looting on this thing? We have luck one. <clears throat> Slash back. There it is. Hold on. I need to see if did a zombie drop his head. I can't tell if a zombie dropped his head or not. It doesn't seem like it. You know what we're gonna do? We are going to add some luck to this uh to this thingy, my bobber. We need to add some luck to this sword. If we're going to be trying this stuff. Like, seriously. <sighs> this episode is taking a lot longer than I thought it would. You know? Here, let's grab some lapis. We've got, we got some lapis inside the, the, the house here. It's not going to be enough to fully upgrade our sword. To like looting three or maybe it is it isn't of course i would be 20 short because the game hates me so much dot com yeah we don't have a whole lot of um yeah that what that gets us like walk walk two that's not enough but maybe it is for now. Maybe it is for now. You know? Lapis? Ooh, I'll take that nebulous heart, though. I will totally take that nebulous heart. That is four ender pearls in my pocket. Oh, yeah. That would be amazing. All right, let's go back into the hunting dimension and hope and pray that we can, you know, potentially find some stuff. Alright, I, did I bring torches? I have torches. Why the f flying heck am I not using them? I don't care about skeletons. I just want zombies. Can't tell if that's an enderman. No, it's a skeleton for sure. Got the creeper in front of us. I don't appreciate creepers. That is a charge creeper. That's another charge creeper right there. All right, if I can drag those two charge creepers close to a zombie, I might be able to get them to drop the head. The skeleton. Shit. You Enderman, I just pissed off an Enderman. I just pissed off an Enderman. There it is. Dot com. I just pissed off an Enderman. Dot com. Boo! All right, guys. I'll be right back as soon as I get a zombie head. Alrighty, guys. So we've got everything that we need. Oh wait, we're gonna need another machine, I think. Okay, we're going to need electrical steel, which is going to be steel plus silicon. Um, we're going to need a couple more machines. Oh, you got to be kidding me, right? We're going to need at least an, an, an Enderman head. And uh, some other stuff as well. Um, tiny progression steel. 
Just craft a stack of that shit. That will do. Silicon. Times four. Steel. Times four. I just totally forgot. We're going to need the soul binder. Which also needs another four heads. Oh, my head hurts. Oh, Lord. Um, so let me let that cook up and we'll be right back. Alrighty, guys. So we're going to need a couple of things. We're going to need some capacitors. Capacitors. And I think these actually need the empowerer, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. The double layer capacitor. Hold on. Capacitor. How do you spell it again? Yeah, these guys here. The double layered. Yep, which needs the basics. And then the basics need. Oh, we need more of these. So we need a bunch more of these. I think. We're, we're only going to go up to the double layer anyway. So that's fine. So with the double layer, which needs two energetic alloy. Please tell me I have more of that stuff. Energetic. I do. I have just enough. Would you look at that? And then what do we need in the middle for that guy? Pulverized coal. Coal. Um, we actually might have some of that in our alloy smeltery still. This is exactly why I set up the Empowerer last episode. Whoop, whoop, go me. Go me. I'm super proud of that. I actually didn't do that for that reason, but I just totally remembered that this is Titan mode and I'm going to need it. So there it is, dot com. Uh, I'm feeling good about myself for that. Oh, it's right here in my inventory. No, we're good. So we can just go down straight downstairs and, and work on this bad boy, huh? There it is. Let's go ahead and pop these two things down just like that. Uh, pulverized coal in the middle and two of those just like that. Nice. All right. Now, we're going to have to shove that in there. You should be getting power. Are you not getting power? Are you not hooked up yet? Ah, you're not hooked up yet. That's why. Okay. Let's go ahead and get those leadstones connected in. Where did I do with my leadstones? There they are. There we go. Nice, nice. Put this back so it's all nice and things. All right, good. You're getting power. So let's go ahead and grab our zombie head, two silicon and two solarium and a redstone. And that should get us our Z-Logic controller in theory. And that should get us our um, powered spawner. Uh, so zombie head. Where did our zombie head go? Oh, it's right there. Perfect. Uh, silicon, which we don't have a lot of that. Two silicon and some redstone and a solium times two. There we go. Let's go ahead and shove this stuff in here. So you, you, you. Oh, we forgot the redstone. Right. Redstone. Oh, you know what's going to be a pain in the ass? Getting ourselves three more heads because we need a soul binder to um, do what we need to do. So I will probably have that for next episode. I'll probably do that between episodes because, again, that's just a huge pain in the butt to get the heads that we need. Unless between episodes I make a cleaver and then, then, you know, get the heads that way, which is what I was going to do in today's episode. But yeah, got a little sidetracked, if you will. All right, there we go. We've got iron now, which we just need a pair of shears and an iron axe. So let's grab some sticks. Man, this cheap AE system is kind of annoying. I kind of want to go and explore the world and get the rest of the AE patterns that we need to, uh, you know, get things on the ball rolling, but it is what it is. We can go ahead and do this and 
put you in there and you in there and that should in theory make our z logic controller that we need okay good 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 all right i think that is a perfect spot to wrap up the episode though if you guys did enjoy today's episode of project ozone 3 um titan mode overworld I would greatly appreciate it if you would hit that like button, smash that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell so you guys get notifications when every video goes live from now on. Make sure to follow me on all my social medias, Instagram, Twitter, all that stuff will be down in the description below as well as my Discord. So, it's been your boy Hunter X. I'm going to love you. I'm going to you. See you guys next time. Bye, guys.